Right. The next one you guys can see is kind of like a uh, another chain rule. So automatically looking into this, dy over dx. Um, <clears throat> if I want to find the derivative here, I know I can basically just rewrite this as, oh, I'm sorry, u prime over u, right? So actually, this one might be a little bit easier to, to write out. Rather than writing it like this, I'm going to break it out. So I could rewrite this as 1 over uh, u, which is 1 plus ln of x, times the derivative of u, which is really just going to be derivative of this is really just going to be 1 over x. So this would be something where it would be important for you to just be careful as far as writing u prime over x. It's not like it would be wrong, but then you'd have to be dealing with fractions in the numerator and denominator, which would actually be more work for you. So recognizing here, now all I'm simply going to do is just multiply them. So dy over dx is going to be 1 over x times 1 plus ln of x. Okay. All right.